attended an invitation-only picnic at Cranbrook, which is a perfect spot to see the Dream Cruise because it's right on Woodward. At this picnic, they had a large variety of food. Uh, they had a Caesar salad, they had a pasta salad, hot dogs, hamburgers, uh, different, different kinds of picnic food, sandwiches, they had lemonade, they had iced tea. I mean, a whole variety of different kinds of food. And it was buffet style, so you could just go and pick whatever you like. You guys know that I'm not a big meat eater, so I didn't have the hamburger, but I did enjoy a hot dog. And of course, Caesar salad is my favorite. They had um, chips there as well, like you can see here. And they had little packs of like relish and mustard and ketchup that you could put on your hot dogs. So very nice picnic. And they had fresh watermelon where I'll show you that later. I love cut up watermelon. So they had that as well. So a large variety of picnic foods that you could choose from. They had enormous barbecues in the back, which were grilling up all of these hamburgers and hot dogs. So it was so much fun to see and the smell was amazing. As I mentioned, this picnic was at Cranbrook, which is perfect because look, the Dream Cruise is right there. That's Woodward Avenue. Guys, I have no idea if you guys can hear me or not. The car noise is so much here. Look at this lemonade. It's so delicious, so refreshing. Hot dog, a Caesar salad, and some potato chips with lemonade. weather out here perfect day for the dream cruise the woodward dream cruise happens to be the world's largest one day automotive event and the cruise is held on the third saturday of every august and it's just a one day event held annually so it's something that you if you're a car lover it's definitely for you and you shouldn't miss it at all and here is the watermelon it was such a perfect uh picnic fruit to enjoy on it was sweet it was juicy um it was cold absolutely delicious watermelon mm. This parade of cars runs northbound along the entire course of Woodward Avenue from Ferndale to Pontiac Michigan there's always a huge turnout for this event and they say approximately 1.5 million people attend this event and almost they have 40,000 classic cars each year from around the globe. This cruise always draws thousands of classic cars. I mean, you can see it right here. They have classic cars, they have new cars, they had electrical vehicles. I also um, filmed this last year as well. This gets bigger and better every year. It's amazing to see the turnout at the Dream Cruise. There's so many people lined up across Woodward. They have the rev it up signs. And I mean, it is amazing event to attend. Anyone who is a car lover needs to come out to Michigan on the 3rd August, on the 3rd Saturday of August to see this Dream Cruise. It is absolutely amazing. And I'm telling you, you will not be disappointed, especially if you're a car lover. Here is a bright red shiny fire truck, classic fire truck from Cranbrook. And here is another beauty coming up. Look at this red, beautiful classic car. It is absolutely a beauty to look at. I mean, the kids were so, they were looking at the fire truck, then they would run over here to look at this car. It is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this car. I mean, it speaks for itself. And what picnic would be complete without ice cream? Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. So they had this little ice cream stand there as well. So my husband and I enjoyed some ice cream together. A popsicle. Mm. Uh, 
uh, for the Cranbrook picnic, they also have the miniature golf opened as well as the museum. So I'm going to quickly show you guys those things as well and then continue back on the Woodward Cruise. So right now we're headed towards the miniature golf. For those of you who are familiar with Cranbrook, uh, right by their art museum, they do have this miniature golfing course. So it's a lot of fun for kids as well as adults. It's called Cranbrook on the Green. And I did include all the information for you guys. I believe they do accept reservations as well. So it's a lot of fun. There were a lot of kids out there. Um, we tried our hand at it as well. It's a very nice course. It's a lot of fun. Um, so definitely, if you're in the area, check this out. Please do keep in mind that the prices that I'm about to show you guys about um, how much it costs to do miniature golfing here are subject to change. So just give them a call or go down there to verify the rates because they are subject to change. These are their hours and their rates. So go check out the miniature golf at Cranbrook. Oh, not bad. <laughs> a big golfer but my husband loves to play golf so i definitely tried this um i did my best i think i did pretty well so you'll see towards the end how well i did my husband is big on sports and he takes every game very seriously okay, I got so three. he is totally I got into this and he yeah. wants to win as you go through this course, it does get harder and harder. So I'm warning you guys ahead of time, but it is a lot of fun. We had a great time doing this and the weather was perfect to go miniature golfing. And um, I tried my best to do it here. This uh, particular section was quite hard, but you'll see shortly how well my husband did here. Seriously? Are you serious? <laughs> I guess you won. Unfortunately, I did lose that miniature golf game and my husband won, but it's a fantastic course. It's a lot of fun. So come and check it out. I do believe uh, they do take reservations uh, for the miniature golf. So call them ahead of time to make reservations. This is the course. Okay, we had fun miniature golfing. Now it's time to head back to the Dream Cruise. So let's go and enjoy the Dream Cruise. I'm sure a lot of you are wondering that what is the charge to attend this dream cruise there is absolutely no charge it is completely free of charge you just have to pack um, the right things to enjoy it and i will go into that a little bit later the picnics that you do see along um, woodward avenue those are sometimes invitation only but it is completely free of charge to attend this event last year when i recorded this dream cruise for you guys it was so super hot this year the weather is so nice it's um a little cloudy today so it feels so nice it's perfect weather for this dream cruise i'm going to show you guys from the outside as well i'm going to just stick it out of the sunroof just like that and show you guys If it is your first time uh, to the Dream Cruise, I would highly recommend finding a good spot somewhere between Royal Oak and Birmingham because that is that area around that area, that stretch gets like the most amount of traffic and the most um, excitement. So I would highly recommend if you're coming out for the very first time, try to find a spot between Royal Oak and Birmingham because that area gets so much traffic, so much excitement. Some things to consider if you guys are coming out here. Uh, you guys understand that classic cars get very, very loud. And so anyone who's sensitive to extreme noises should definitely bring earplugs because it does get very, very loud. Uh, the cars are revving up their engines. So I would highly recommend earplugs if you do have a noise sensitivity. Uh, the folding chairs are definitely a must it's because you want somewhere to sit and i would bring water i would bring non-alcoholic drinks i would bring snacks uh, lots and lots of snacks you could pack sandwiches you could have your own little picnic here uh, they do allow tents as you guys can see so bring out the tents bring umbrellas bring folding chairs lots of sunscreen lots of different kind of snacks it is an all-day event if you choose it to be. If you want to stay there all day, definitely this is an all-day event. Just be prepared with the extras because sometimes the weather doesn't cooperate and it does get hot or it can rain. So just be prepared accordingly to the weather. But I did um, recommend a few things, so definitely keep that in mind if you guys are coming out there. 
hopefully next august i will see all of you guys out there enjoying this dream cruise because it is definitely a must see and i would highly recommend it if you are a car lover get out here it is definitely worth it just look at all of these amazing cars what beauties i mean you can see every car in the book if there's a particular car that you are looking for i can almost guarantee that you will find it here it is literally a car lover's paradise all these cars coming up are electric cars um, by Chevrolet. So keep in mind, these are all electric. I know some people must be wondering how safe is it to attend this event. It is extremely safe. They have a huge, I mean, you can see right here, they had a SWAT car there. I mean, they have a lot of police out here. It is extremely safe. I mean, all along this uh, road, all along this path, they have so many police officers. So it is definitely a safe event. I'm gonna stop talking for a little bit and let you guys enjoy the sounds of the Woodward Dream Cruise. all of you guys enjoyed uh, going to the Woodward Dream Cruise with me. I always have a fantastic time and I'm so glad I got to share this with you again. If you guys haven't seen the previous year, definitely go check out my vlog on that as well. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you already haven't done so. And if you have, thank you so much. Remember, always believe in yourself, love yourself and take care of yourself. Until next time from the Woodward Dream Cruise, 2022 Woodward Dream Cruise. Bye guys.